Hello everyone, in today's video we are in Hoi An which is about 30 minutes from Da Nang. I wanted to make this video for anybody who wanted to have a little getaway from Da Nang but you don't want to get on a flight, then Hoi An is definitely a good option for you. It's just about 30 minutes from Da Nang. You can get a grab car here or you can even just ride your motorbike. So I'm going to give you a tour of where we're staying and all the activities that we're going to do. So if you're ready, let's get started. So we're currently staying at the Sunrise Premier Resort and as you walk in, I love that it takes you to the outside area. This is so pretty. I think this is reminiscent of the Maldives and there's little like pool tables and stuff that you guys can do here. Let me show you guys the room that we picked. So we are staying in one of the suites and as you walk in, you guys will see there. I'm going to give you a full view first when you go out. You have a view of the tennis court and the beach on this side, which is really pretty. And I like how simple it is. So you have just a nice big bed. TV is right here, a little seating area, a nice little desk to work. And what I really liked about them, guys, is that they're very sustainable. They give you those bottles that you can just refill at every station. At the end of the hall, there's a station for you to refill, so you don't have to use plastic water bottles. Also, Ralph and I stayed in Hoi An last year, and I think we stayed in a villa, so that's also a great option if you guys just wanna have your own little private villa. I'll put the link to that video over here, but I wanted to give you the option of also staying in a resort, so you can have both options if you're coming here. Now, next thing we're gonna talk about is food. One of my favorite restaurants in Hoi An is called Verenda. Verenda is a nice restaurant that has vegan and vegetarian options, and I really like their food. My favorite is the Pesto Bagel, it's delicious definitely must try if you're going there and they also have vegan ice cream so it's really good we actually got uh, rum raisin there's chocolate and there's also cookies and cream which you guys can definitely try another restaurant that i really like is called coco casa and coco casa is actually located in front of the river they have a very interesting almost mexican style they have art on the wall they have very quirky furniture they have bean bags on the grass and it's overlooking the river so it's a really cool place so i wanted to show you guys a quick clip of that Okay, so we just got the food. Ralph got some vegetables with some rice, and I got the same thing, but mine is eggplant, and we got some coconuts. This place is gonna light up at night. Okay, once I take that first bite, this is about to start lighting up. <laughs> Now let's talk about activities. You guys have probably seen Hoi An in many pictures and you've seen the lantern, you've seen the old city, which is really a big part of Hoi An. If you go there, you go to the old city and you see the beautiful lanterns by the river. There's boat shows. There are all these activities there, which I think is definitely a thing you must check out. I believe I did show that in my last video. However, in this video, I wanted to show you guys more to Hoi An because even me living here, I didn't even realize there was more here. And what we found out is that there is a water park Park and kind of attraction park here. It's a little bit outside of Hoi An. You have to keep going south, but only about 20 minutes from Hoi An. And that one was definitely worth it. This attraction is called Vin Pearl Land and Vin Pearl Land is basically a small Disneyland. <laughs> it has a water park, it has attraction, it has a safari and it also has shows. It's definitely great to have that here because we did go to one in Fukuok which is really good. You had to take the cable cart to go to the water park but it's only a water park and the fact that they have many things in just one area I think actually brings a lot more people to it. I'm actually going to show you guys a clip of that because we just went yesterday so here you go so i wanted to show you the map of vin wonders because the different areas you guys can see there's a water park on this side there's the amusement park right here over here there's a bunch of shows and activities we're going to check them out and over here you'll see the safari so we're going to go and walk around and everything is surrounded by this big lake That's that right. you can go around Tell them.
He's getting your hair. <laughs> hey, he bit my finger. Oh, where is he going? Are you getting oh, she my like clothes? Bikini. My bikini? <laughs> yeah, she likes your bikini. He's, he likes your hair. <laughs> Itchy! <laughs> <laughs> Imagine if look, this arm. big will pull. Yes. He's gonna bite you. Oh no, you I want him to come him. to me. Yeah, ah! I told you. Hey guys, it's a few hours later and we stopped at La Plage. La Plage is a lounge slash restaurant area located on the beach in Hoi An. One of the things that I like about Hoi An is that the beach has a separation. So when you're in Hoi An, you won't really see the beach from the road because there's a bit of a hill there and then you'll see the beach. So I'm gonna show you guys a tour of where we are at La Plage. As you walk in, you'll see it's like a regular restaurant, but you can see the beach in the end. And you'll actually have to take stairs down to the beach, which is what I really like about it. And here you can see over there is Chem Island. So we sat here and we decided to come and get something to eat here just for a little snack during the day. So Ralph and I decided to have some crepes and coconut water right on the beach. I mean, say it babe, isn't that create a life worth living? It is. <laughs> yeah. I don't even know what day it is. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, and it's pretty inexpensive. Cha la plage mon amour. I get it. <laughs> A life worth living. Okay guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this quick video of Hoi An. I just wanted to show you guys something that you can do outside of Da Nang if you wanted to just get away for a weekend. Anyway, we're going to finish enjoying this and then maybe we'll chill by the beach. Alright guys, I hope to see you in the next video. Goodbye!